Hey guys, Sponge Murphy here. So uh, just an update video for the Vargas models, and uh, I've been kind of looking for an opinion with the colours that I've chosen so far with this. Um, you know, it's kind of it's a bit of a radical choice. It's um, it's like a nice blue and a red. So, but and I'm hoping that in the end it'll turn out pretty good because when I first put the base cuts in without putting the wash over I really thought I was after making a big mistake here but then once I put the wash on it and then I highlighted one of the other ones a bit more you know it started to look pretty decent so let's zoom in a bit more so um, let's have a quick look at this guy here so the first base coat was it was um, a 2 to 1 mixture of denim stone and ice blue and then and then I washed it down with Agrax or Jet and um what was this one? Oh scab red then just for that I haven't done anything else to that yet so and I washed it down after but I'm not sure how where, how how much I'm going to highlight it up yet because I'm just trying to focus more on the skin for now. So um yeah I think it's once the washing gone and then I kinda started to figure out what way I'm going to highlight it or build the skin tone up it um it started to really kind of take shape a little bit I think once you start with the base coats of models at the start I think they all kind of start to look a bit terrible you start getting cold feet about them you know starting off but um but this guy here this is the guy this is this guy has just the base colors on him and then the wash over him and this guy here I went over the higher parts of the skin with the denim stone and ice blue again I think it really starts to take shape now it looks a lot nicer than than just the flat colours on it so then I'm going to build up the lighter colours on the edges then again so I really think with this way I did it it's starting to take shape a lot more because when I had it like this I was really thinking I'm after making a big mistake I really shouldn't have picked these colours but then slowly I started to build up this one today and you know it's looking pretty decent like it's not perfect or it's not brilliant or anything but you know it's starting to take shape the colours are pretty good I'm just hoping that I can get the wings to look uh, just as good you know just to match uh, just as good as the skin to match like zoom in a bit more full stuff focusing on the background you now just leave kind of the dark parts in the recesses there just work on the highlights of the muscles yeah so I'm um, I think it could, I think it's gonna work out pretty good with these colors I did try these colors before with the ghoul king that I did for the terrain square challenge and I really didn't think that I nailed it that well and honestly I don't know why I chose it again because it was a color that I didn't you know nail down that good but um I think it's, it's looking good so far with this one. I get the other two done with the with other highlights on it and then I start making it build it up lighter and lighter on the edges and all again. And then work on the fur and then hopefully get the wings and all sorted. I was going to start the wings last night, but kind of no matter what way I well to hold them. I was just gonna do the skin parts, that's what it was. But um I didn't have anything like the hold them properly. Like if I held that part it's gonna be covering the skin. So I don't have any like little clipper things handy. So I'll just leave them till the end. So I'm really looking for your opinions on this. Let me know what you guys think. If the colours are really working or you think it's going to look out better when they're finished. Just let me know in the comment section. Um, hit the like button. And if you haven't, subscribe. And uh, once again, thanks for watching. And keep an eye for an update soon. Thanks for watching, guys.